With each new Apple product release, new features are added to the devices making it complicated to use. I think the company knew this well in advance and came up with a solution by creating the first digital virtual assistant called Siri. While many people are familiar with the standard Siri commands like checking the weather, open a certain app, set up a timer, etc. Many new functions are taught to Siri regularly that you might not be aware of. Hi there, if you're here to learn more about Siri's new commands, I have compiled a list of 10 useful Siri tricks you should try. I also want to let you know, I'm using iPad for this video that is running on iPadOS 15.7 and I believe the tricks I'm about to show you should work on the latest versions of iPhone as well. Let's start. Apple's dark and light modes are designed to provide a comfortable viewing experience for your device. You can use the dark theme throughout the day, but if you only want to use it at night, it's not very convenient to switch it on and off daily. A better method can be to ask Siri to change the mode. Let's say I want my device in light mode. So I'll say, hey Siri, switch to light mode. Okay, light mode is now on. As you can see, it changes the whole mode which is useful when viewing under the sunlight. Following from the previous step, you can change your device's brightness by asking Siri to dim or lighten the screen. Some of you may prefer this method than changing from the control center. For example, Siri, set brightness to 50%. Okay, I made the screen brighter. Or, Siri, I want maximum brightness. Okay, this is as bright as it gets. The same can be applied to increase or decrease volume level. Siri, lower the volume level, please. Okay, media will play softer. Or, Siri, set volume levels to 60%. Media volume set to 60%. This next trick is a favorite of mine. Siri has the ability to perform simple and complex calculations quickly, which can be helpful when you don't want to manually use a calculator. Hey Siri, calculate 2428963 multiplied by 56 divided by 8. The answer is 170,027,571. You can even continue the calculation from here by saying, Siri, Continue to previous calculation, subtract 89854. The answer is 169,937,717. In addition to this, you can ask questions like, how many minutes are there in 23 years? 12,096,831.6 minutes. Amazing, right? If you want to see images related to a certain topic, simply say, Hey Siri, show me photos related to the topic name. Here are some images of related to iPhone 14 Pro Max from the web. You will instantly see it without having to manually search it by going into the web browser and then finding it. It's quick and a brilliant feature. Generally, to take a screenshot, we use the side button and home button on iPhone and top button and home button on iPad. I'm sure many of you must not be knowing this as well, but instead of doing this, I would recommend you to use Siri. For example, Siri, kindly take a screenshot of this. It's wonderful to see how virtual assistants have become so versatile and able to do this as well. Many of us use an app like Shazam or Soundhound for music recognition. In iOS, Shazam already comes built in. Rather than using this through the control center or downloading one of the apps, you can ask Siri to do this job. All you have to do is, Hey Siri, can you identify the song? Siri will start listening and once it recognizes, it will present you with the song name and artist. Did you know that Siri has the ability to turn on or off various features in our devices like Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, airplane mode, etc. To use this, say, Hey Siri, turn on Bluetooth. Okay, I turned Bluetooth on. Or, hey Siri, turn off Wi-Fi. Okay, 
Wi-Fi is now off. This is a good perk of using this voice assistant. Siri is known to speak many languages and it can translate in some of the well-known ones like French, Spanish, Arabic, etc. Hey Siri, translate where are you going in Spanish? In Spanish, where are you going is? ¿A dónde vas? The next time you're talking to someone who speaks another language, you can rely on Siri. Not many people will be knowing this, but Siri can read you short stories. All you have to do is say, Hey Siri, tell me a short story. One day, a little cloud named Cumulus decided it would like to see the world. Hanging out with the big clouds had become a bit dull over time. See you around, said Cumulus, and sped off. Be back for the rain, the big clouds shouted. Every few days, you'll get a different story, so don't forget to hear them out. Siri is a knowledgeable assistant who knows a lot about important events, famous figures, nutritional information, and more. Let's see. Hey Siri, tell me something about Roger Federer. Roger Federer is a Swiss professional tennis player. He was ranked world number one by the Association of Tennis Professionals for 310 weeks, including a record 237 consecutive weeks, and has finished as the year-end number one five times. Hey Siri, when is Diwali? Diwali is on Monday, October 24th, 2022. Or, hey Siri, how many calories are there in a burger? A hamburger has about 232 calories. She's got answers to all your questions. Siri is an excellent addition to our Apple devices and with a variety of functions available, I recommend you use them as they're very helpful. What are your favorite ways to use Siri? Let us know in the comments. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next week in a new video. Bye.